like come to wikiprocedures.videos.com. In this video, we will see how to report street lights which is not working in Andaman. The link appearing on the screen is also provided in the description box below. So please click on it to reach the wiki procedure website. Once you reach the website, you can see that in the top left corner of the page, if you click on select language, there are several languages available options. So uh, you can click on whichever language that you're comfortable in to view the procedure in that language. Then if you scroll below, below the title, you can see that uh, there are var various sections available like procedure, required documents, office location, etc. Uh, each of the uh, section will be providing relevant information regarding the procedure. So the first section, if you click on it, we'll go to the procedure section. Here you can see that this particular procedure that is complaining on street light outage can be done through two different means. That is through, in, that is in person and through online. Obviously through online is the most convenient way. So to do that, what you need to do is click on this link over here that we have provided, EESL complaint registration link. Once you click on it, and uh, I recommend that you right click on the link and uh, select open link tab to open the link. That way you'll, uh, the link, the page will open in a new tab and you'll still be able to return to our page to view the remainder of the instructions. So, once you clicked on the link, you'll be taken to this page, Computer Complaint Registration page. Here, you need to fill in the details like uh, caller number. So you need to fill in your mobile number, 10 digit mobile number. Uh, please provide the valid mobile number so that the authorities will be able to contact you. Then you need to select the, your preferred language. Um, I'm selecting English here. Then you need to select the scheme. Under scheme, you need to select street light. Once you click on street light, you can see that more questions are appearing. Then you need to select the state, Andaman and Nicobar. Then select the district. Then here you need to type in your name. Uh, please type in your full name. And uh, then you need to select the light type. And uh, under this, there are two options available, LED and non-LED. But uh, if you see here, we have mentioned non-LED type of complaints will not be registered. So here you can only select LED type, okay? Then uh, here you need to type in your address. Uh, be sure to type in your door number, your PIN code, everything, so that uh, it will be easier to contact you. Then please provide a landmark as well. Next, you need to select the ULB is PBMC, then select the zone, zone and then uh, here you need to type in the ward, sector or society name. It is not mandatory but uh, typing it in would uh, help the authorities get to you easily. Next you need to uh, type in the poll number. This is very important. Please type the poll number of the street light. Then you need to select area type. Under area type, there are three options available, single, multiple, and complete street. Uh, if your uh, complaint is about this one street light, you need to select single. If you're complaining about multiple street lights, that is three to four street lights which have gone out, then you need to select multiple. Otherwise, if uh, the entire street has no street lights working, then you need to select complete street. So select whichever one is appropriate. Then you need to select the ticket type. For that, you need to select lamp. Then here, uh, this space is for typing in your remark. And uh, this is not mandatory, but it will be useful if you could uh, give some remarks like uh, uh, whatever you feel is the reason for the lamp not working. Like, is it broken or uh, has it gone old or whatever remark it is. You type it here it will be useful next you need to enter in the capture code that's given here uh, please type in the correct capture code then you need to click on save 
once you click on save uh, complaint id number will appear here to view that uh, if you click on this link over here right next to the apply online section we are given a link if you click on that link you'll see the steps that i just explained to you right now we have provided it with images so if you scroll down and uh, if you see you can see this image here uh, where uh, the complaint reference number is provided and you need to you need to copy that number and uh, keep it safe for future reference uh, the same number will also be sent to you via sms to the mobile number that we just shared so um, please keep that number safe for future reference and uh, you can also use that number to track your complaint by typing it over here right above the form that you just filled you have this uh, uh, text box here so if you type in the complaint id over here and click on search you will be able to track the status of your complaint that ends the online procedure method another way of applying is in person for this you need to visit the port blair municipal council office in person the address and contact details you can click on this link over here to view that will be taken to this page and uh, here you can see the name of the officer their contact number their email ids all the details are provided here so uh, you can even contact them in advance before visiting them in person so what you need to do before visiting is you need to write a letter to the officer uh, regarding the street light problem and in that letter we need to add details like uh, location of the street light type of issue poll number and uh, any other uh, remarks that you need to make and also uh, importantly you need to provide uh, your uh, personal information uh, like uh, name your mobile number and your email id this is very important because they uh, this these details will help them get back to you then you need to submit the letter to the officer along with some supporting documents like uh, your identity proof and your address proof the id proof and address proof can be anything like uh, your voter id your uh, um, work id any uh, id that has your uh, name and your address in it you need to submit that along with the letter once you've done that the authorities will verify whether the complaint is uh, correct and then uh, they will uh, assign an electrician to repair the outage problem moving on to the next section here you can see the uh, the two documents that you need to uh, provide along with your letter is your id proof and your address proof then in this section we have provided the address details of the office that you need to visit we have also provided a link here which will take you to this page here you will find more phone number and more email ids for you to contact then here in the eligibility section you can see that any person can uh, raise an issue or a complaint regarding the uh, street light outage so um, not much eligibility is required there and then um, in the fee section you can see that uh, the service is free of charge so it will not be charged for this complaint next in the processing section you can see that uh, the processing time that is the time that will be taken to resolve the issue of the street light will depend on the office that you are approaching and on the availability of the manpower so uh, um, it can take any number of days to get it done depending on the availability of an electrician next section is required information section here you can see these are the details that you need to provide uh, in order to register your complaint so 
which is the type of the problem in the street light, street light location, street light poll numbers, and your address details. Next, in this section, uh, need for the document, you can see that the reason you need to raise this complaint is uh, one because like, due to lack of light because it's not working. And another reason is uh, a lack of light can also lead to crime, like chain snatching cases and uh, many accidents. So it's best to uh, raise the complaint as soon as possible and get the light street lamp fixed as soon as possible. That brings us to the end of the procedure. Wikiprocedure.videos.com Thanks you once again for visiting us on how to know how to report street light which is not working in Andaman. Thank you.